I have an Instagram crush. Now let's 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 go back a little bit. Let, let's talk about what a crush is. Uh, it can be subjective, but a crush to me is somebody that you're infatuated with um, to a certain level. Uh, maybe you want to meet them. Maybe you want to have sex with them. Uh, maybe you want to like get to know them better. Um, I don't think it's something to where you're like just head over heels in love with them and you can't stop thinking about them. That's not a crush to me. Crush is like wow. My crush is somebody that I want to meet. I want to meet and not even a sex thing. You know, I know, I, trust me, I like to get laid like the rest of the guys out there, but it, it's it's just more of a crush, right? So I do have a crush um, on Instagram. I, I cannot mention, I've mentioned in my lives who she is. I showed, uh, I showed Mobile Instinct this girl, and he was like, yeah, she's hot, dude. I'm like, yeah, well, obviously, bro. And I'm not going to say where she lives because I think, well, I know, I, I know she watches my videos, at least on this channel, I think. I don't know if she watches the other channel. I don't remember if it was this channel or the other channel. I think it was the other channel. But um, I, I was like, okay, I'll say it like this. Where she lives at, I'm going to be there next year. I'm thinking about hitting her up and just be like, "Hey, let's go have let's go have dinner." Like like now obviously no sex involved because I mean, you know what? Here's the thing. I can't say she's out of my league cuz I, I don't feel any woman is out of my league. I don't know why. I live in a fucking van and I'm I, you know, I'm not the best looking guy. Only certain women find me attractive, but I don't feel any woman's out of my league. I mean, financially, okay, yeah, maybe. But other than that, like, you know, and everything else, not really. I mean, yeah, I, I feel like I, I feel that if I, 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 this is how I look at it with, with women. Um, if I met a woman, you know, it's just like all guys, you know, it's it's always better to have some kind of physical uh, attribute that you have that women deem attractive. You got to have one. You have to have one, guys. Uh, whether it be. Uh, you're just good looking overall. You got a nice head of hair. Uh, you got nice teeth. Uh, you got a the, your demeanor is uh, is nice. Uh, the way you the way you speak. Um, your body. You got a muscular body. All of that stuff. That's that's that is not important to a woman, but that's important to a woman to get her to talk to you, right? And then when you talk to her, if you can make her okay, fuck. If you make good money or you got a nice car, that helps, right? If you can make her laugh once at least, but throughout, if you can make her laugh just in general, bro, you already at second base, nigga. You're already at second base. I mean, I'm not saying she's going to fuck you, but when she's like, <laughs> that's what she's thinking. <laughs> yeah, I mean, maybe. So, I mean, she's not out of my league in terms of physicality, but I mean, she's, she's hot. You know what I mean? She's, she's, she's the hottest chick on Instagram other than that TikTok broad. And then even then when you put them together, I don't know. I, well, the TikTok broad is probably hotter, but she's more, she's more stunning. I don't know. It's kind of weird, but. But I also have a, a, a girl on TikTok that's, she's a half crush, right? She's a half crush. So this other girl on TikTok, so this one is kind of odd. You're going to want to listen to this one. So this broad, I don't believe I follow her, but her TikToks come up in my feed, I guess, because I'll, I'll look at her. Now, I showed I showed Mobile Instinct, her, and he was, uh, he was like, nah, dude. Now, this girl is not ugly. She's just not cute. But I think she's cute, right? She's one of those girls that, okay, I, I've often said this. I've often said this. For me to date a woman, you have to be at least a four. You've got to be a four. When I say that, I mean this. A four to me is a little below average at best, right? But you better have a killer ass personality. And to me, at the end of the day, 
a woman could be deemed like like homely looking. I can't be with an ugly woman. I can't do the ugly. But if you're homely, but you're you're like you're just awesome. I don't care. Yeah, that, we're all good to go. And this chick on TikTok, I, she's like kind of homely looking to the uh, the casual eye. But to me, I, she's cute. She has the. I don't know what the. It's her personality. It's her personality, and I and I know she has a husband because one of her TikToks, she was like, "Yeah, my husband." When I do this, and I'm just like, "Damn, why is she fucking married?" See, a girl like that. See, the the, the, the other chick I was talking about, she she ain't. I mean, she has a kid, but this one, I don't know. She probably has a kid too. But yeah, I mean, I, you know, I'm not looking for any kind of relationship or a girlfriend. Now, I'm I'm not saying I don't want to be in one. What I'm saying is, I'm not looking for one. But, you know, I'll tell you the truth. I mean, it feels good to have a partner in your life, you know? It feels good to have a partner in your life. And, uh, yeah, I know she could roll in the, in, the, in the captain's chair. You know what I mean? The Starship Banger Price! You know what I want to do next year? I know, I know, like, my channels are predicated on me traveling a lot. I would, I would like to stay somewhere for six months, but I can't do it. I wish I could. I, you know what? I wish I could, you know, because I, I, you know, I always talk about wanting to get in shape, and then I just, I can, then I start drinking, and I start eating Panda Express. By the way, I don't know why. I used to hate Panda Express. I used to hate it. Now I freaking love it. I want it right now. Um, I'll eat it like not this side of next because I'm gonna I, like I, I, I'm 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 laying off the drinking for another week and then uh, I'm probably just gonna only do like fr like Friday Saturday. I love Pen Express. It's it's awesome. It is absolutely awesome. Got that neck beard rocking now. Yeah, I'm taking this all off. Next video, I should be clean shaven. I should be as smooth as a baby's bottom. But uh, yeah, the Instagram broad. Mm. Yeah, I, I, you know, it, it, here's the thing. Like, she knows who I am, right? Obviously. Um, when I feel weird hitting her up and be like, hey, you know, if I'm in, if I'm in your area, let's say, here's the thing. Here's what I'm guessing. Because I, I know she's like a, like a anti-Trump weirdo, right? Because I see her Instagram. She's like posting anti-Trump memes. And I'm like, you know, she obviously knows that I love Trump and he is going to run again. And I believe he's going to win. But um, other than that, I mean, should I hit her up? Should I hit her up and say, hey, you know, I'd like to have dinner with you. Not lunch. No, no, fuck. Okay, this is what having lunch or having dinner is. Having lunch is what a guy does when he's playing it cool and he doesn't want to think that he's trying to get laid. Having dinner is like, no, you're interested in this person and you want to, you know, dinner and drinks, whatever. That's what I want. I want to take her to a nice restaurant, have drinks just and, and listen again i know you guys are like, you just want to fuck well yeah don't we all don't we all but that ain't gonna happen i mean dude she's she's so damn hot dude she probably has guys always 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 bothering him but anyways i know i'm gonna ask her out uh when i get out there it's uh, i'll be out there in may i not gonna say what state she's in because in case she's i don't think she watches my videos i don't think she watches these i don't think she watches videos i not many not many girls like on this channel watch these videos you know what i mean but um no i'll be out there in the summertime and uh you know next year you know my travels i i don't plan on coming to the east coast but i don't know but uh yeah i would like to stay somewhere six months and just join the boot camp. that's that's at least three months you know what, guys? I'm not going to lie. Maybe I'll do it in California. Maybe I'll stay for three months and, and, and you know, where the weather's good and then I can just kind of stay base somewhere. I highly doubt I can do that. But anyways, I'll hit her up when I get out there. We'll see what she says. Catch up with y'all later. Peace.